Hey everybody, my name is Ken. I am an English teacher here in Thailand. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you my laptop stand that is super cheap, super strong, super awesome, and I think you might wanna get it too. So let's go check it out. This is my desk at work. Uh, this could be anything. This could be your dinner table. This could be uh, a library table where you study. But this is my table and I'm gonna break out the laptop and the laptop stand out of my backpack. It took me a long time. First thing that comes out, of course, is the laptop. Second thing that comes out, and you can see it's really small, is the laptop stand. Now, I want you to listen to this. It is made of metal, it's not made of plastic. some beats too. Yeah, all right. So here it is, the portable laptop stand. Is this something that you should get? Is it durable? Is it a quality piece of product? Well, I want to let you know that there are many different variations of this product online, whether it's eBay, Amazon, Shopee, Lazada, AliExpress. The overall design is the same, but there are some minor differences, and I'll talk about those first. So all of them have this sort of X frame that provides stability of your laptop when it's up. Now, if we elevate the legs up and examine the feet, you can see that there are six notches one, two, three, four, five, six. Some products do not have a notch like what you see right here. Some other variations of this, they actually have a perforation, a hole. So what that means is that this, this little toe right here, it'll actually go through the foot. In this product, we don't have that and while I love this, I take it everywhere, if this broke, I would get the exact same version of it. But what I don't like is you are fully dependent upon gravity for this to stay in place. If you want to move your laptop and you pick up your laptop with this, look what happens. You see that? So the foot, it goes down even more, which slips the toe out of the foot and then you gotta readjust it here, and then you gotta come over here and readjust it here. This is a two-hand thing. I mean, a two-hand process. I'm pretty sure you could turn this into a party trick where, where you could kind of figure out how to do it one-handed, uh, but I'm, I'm not that cool, and I don't wanna be that cool. I just keep life simple. And that's why I'm telling you about this product. It makes your life simple and easy. So it's as simple as just opening it up um, from the middle, like so and once it is down this is what you do you need to lift up the feet put the toes in the hole one two and now your laptop is ready to go if this is too steep for you just grab these and take them to the back seat there we are we're super chill in the back of the class, way relaxed. I'm gonna show you what it looks like with a laptop on the first level and the sixth level. So here we are level one. Level one picks your laptop five and a half centimeters off the ground, which is a little bit more than two and one quarter inches. So let's put our laptop up on it. Present the screen to the world. Okay, that's not bad. Let's see what this looks like. So as you can see, this is okay, right? Here is with no stand. And this is with level one on the stand. 
I want you to pay close attention to where it is in respect to my body because the whole reason why you should be using a laptop stand is so that you're not hunching over on your laptop. That's really bad for your neck and your back. You want to have a straight body. So my eyes are right here, but the laptop is down here. All right, we're going to elevate that up to the sixth level. Take off the laptop. Pull up. Okay. Wow. You, you see that? So I'm right here, the laptop is here, and now I can just comfortably type 10 centimeters or four and one quarters inches off the ground. Let me show you what it looks like from my perspective. So this is my computer. Here's the laptop. The laptop is now at the same height as the computer. If I did not have my stand, look how low that is for me. That's not comfortable. This is perfect. That's not perfect. But with the stand, I'm able to do the, the work that I need to do quickly and comfortably without wrecking my neck or back. All right, next, let me show you the build quality of this. The build quality is fantastic. Um, I just wanna zoom in and show you some really impressive features of this. Uh, first of all, these are not plastic, they are silicone. Uh, silicone, is sticky. Well, it's not sticky, but nothing is going to slide around if you have silicone. And they're really durable. As I said before, this is a type of uh, alloy material. It's like a, a mix of aluminum and a different other metal. What I found um, really impressive is the fact that they have screws. Okay. So this makes the product repairable. Not only that, it also makes it customizable. You could probably order some multicolored titanium screws off eBay or some online website to kind of customize this, even though you're never gonna really see the back. What I really love are these right here, although I need to get a new one. These are actually magnets. Here, look at this, watch. This stays on because there's a magnet. How cool is that? This magnet needs to be replaced. But hey, I've had this thing for a long time and that's why I'm making this review. Uh, this particular device is made by Vinchin. A Vinchin is an awesome and responsible Chinese company from 2011. They specialize in making um, audio cables and cords, but they have since expanded into accessories such as laptop stands. Here you can see that I've kind of repaired it a little bit by putting on some double-sided foam tape. This is because, now this is the downside, the, the rubber sliders, they do come off over time, but that's gonna be with any product that you buy because all manufacturers, they use double-sided tape. Uh, I would not recommend super glue. Uh, just do double-sided tape. It's really cheap and easy to buy. Um, that's the easy fix. These silicone stoppers for the um, bottom of the laptop, these have not come off. These are really, really tough. The same for these two. My only problem has been with these two here on the top of it. Uh, let's talk about closing it. So, if the magnets worked, it's really easy to close. You can just go here and then close it like that. But the problem is that if you have one broken magnet like me, and you just try to close it, you can't close it because this piece gets stuck on this arm. So, what I do 
is I just turn it over when I'm finished. There you go. So this is the Vinchin. The Vinchin brand laptop stand. I really hope you enjoyed this review. My name is Ken. Uh, if you want to see more reviews of products that I have used for a long time, definitely add, uh, subscribe to me, give me a like. Uh, the whole reason why I do this product review is because the world is a, it's beautiful. Our world is beautiful, but it's super polluted, guys. And so I really support circle economy and zero waste. We need to be purchasing products that we will actually use and products that are built very well and last a very, very, very long time. And again, when you have products that are repairable, it's something you can use a long time. And who knows, maybe someday I'll, um, I'll add some color or something with like an oil pen, you know, customize it. Uh, amazing product, amazing company. I bought this in Lazada because I live in Thailand. Lazada is the Southeast Asia version of eBay, but it's owned by Alibaba. Uh, you can go online to any online seller. Uh, definitely check out the Vincent brand name. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.